the ring didn't mean a thing, and hasn't for some time. Drew Sedoy revealed on Sunday night's episode of The Real Housewives of Atlanta that she stopped wearing her wedding ring as her marital woes with husband Ralph Pittman intensified in recent years. At first, mine wasn't fitting after the babies. And then as I lost weight, we were having some issues. So I just never put it, back on. I stopped wearing it, Sedora, 37, told her castmates and their husbands during a group dinner filmed in New York City. I should be wearing it. I'm sorry. But at marriage counseling that we just had, we made an agreement which, so, for 30 days, we can't what? She continued, looking directly at Pittman, 39. Argue, attack each other, disrespect. Candy Burns joked in a confessional that the couple will have to keep repeating this challenge for eternity if they plan to make their marriage work. Burris, 46, asked Sidora and Pidman for an update about the assistant drama that has caused serious fissures in their relationship. A former female assistant of Pittman's previously offered him a massage in an allegedly flirty text exchange, putting Sedora, and several of her co-stars, on high alert. I had to fire the assistant, you know? Pittman said, to which his spouse responded, emotionally, I'm still dealing with the fact that we were even dealing with another woman, you know, and even that conversation. Pittman accused Sidora of not making a big enough effort to move beyond the issue. Later, Sidora lamented to Pittman that he tries to make her feel as though the ordeal is nothing but a figment of, her, imagination. In a side conversation, Kenya Moore, who is turning a new leaf with Sidora this season, establishing a friendship after a rocky season 13, told Burris, Sherry Whitfield and Marlo Hampton that she finds Pittman to be an A, Paul. Earlier in the night, she drew comparisons between Pittman's questionable behavior and that of her estranged husband, Mark Daly. After Moore, 51, heard Pittman tell Sidora that they perceived the assistant situation in different ways, the former Miss USA stepped in to defend her new pal. See, let me say this to you right now. If my husband said that to me, I would flip this table over because that is so disrespectful, she asserted. You just said, basically she's lying, how it happened is not how it happened. Moore continued, that would piss me the F, K off if somebody said that to me to my face, especially if I'm hurting. Do you not understand that? You're tearing her down. Sidora said in a confessional that Moore's remarks represented exactly how she felt. I hope Ralph really hears he could be doing some of the same things that she experienced with Mark, she told the camera. And you see where they ended up. Sidora told Page Six this month that her marriage to Pittman, 39, goes through many ups and downs throughout the latest installment of the Bravo reality show. It's just the journey of trying to get through life and trauma and triggers. And you have to be patient on both ends because I'm not always perfect, she said, adding that the two are still committed to couples counseling. He's not always going to be perfect, but, we both marry to stay together forever. A preview for next week's episode sees Pittman learning that Sidora's assistant, Anthony, allegedly spread a rumor that he is gay, gossip that Sidora doesn't seem to buy.
Sedora and Pittman tied the knot in 2014. They share son Makai, 6, and daughter Anaya, 4, and parents son Josiah, 11, from a previous relationship of Sedora's. The Real Housewives of Atlanta airs Sundays at 8 p.m. ET on Bravo.